Morsell. Bounce pa or pass down low, and Galen Smith goes up and puts it down for his first points as a Maryland Terrapin for the Terps in his first appearance in a Maryland uniform. We'll be right back on the Big Ten Network. <laughs> I think it's a Here's Curry, and that one again no good. Fight for the board down low, and Morcell comes away with a long pass down. Wiggins goes up and gets the roll. He had a few looks from the corner, but it's right at the cup where he gets it done. By Navy, looking at a horn set by the Terps. Trying to get some pin down action. Nice on that pass from side. Wiggins to Galen Smith with the dunk. Oh boy, he was overzealous here as Maryland making great reads. Wiggins, mm. Over to Smith for the two-handed dunk right here. Great read out of their horn set. Just flipped it over the shoulder. Maryland staying patient against this 2-3 zone, trying to carve out some space. Take it to that high post and drop it down. Well, Galen Smith is just putting on a show. Set there by Smith to free him. And then more so. Oh, the no look. Down to Galen Smith. Yeah, he was amazing against Morgan. He was four of nine from three in that game. That was... Meanwhile, Aaron Wiggins gets the first two points for Maryland. The way that it fits your personality as a squad. Poku with only the second miss of the game for the Mountaineers. And the senior Galen Smith with a slam inside. Oh, we're seeing Hakeem Hart. He's right in the middle of the screen there. And he pops over and grabs the basketball. He has length to go with that 6'6". Six, six, to the head of Eric Ayala. Little one-hand hammer. And he'll go to the line for a chance at a three-point play. At the St. Peter's bench, like, yeah, okay. Go ahead and jump if you want to. You can put on this poster. Let's take another look there. A Big Ten standout presented by Auto Owners Insurance. Ooh. Working on their stuff, not necessarily working on something specific for St. Peter's. Totally. Uh, you know, you, with the flexibility needed with these schedule changes, you have to concentrate on their own. I can't get the, the gold highlights. I, it just doesn't work for me. Well, I, I can't do any of it. So, as Eric Ayala. Looks, like you said, Kevin, some hard-nosed, physical, tough defense on both ends. Nice feed from Hamilton to Daryl Morsell. Yeah, Mike, he had a 9-0 run by himself, too, so he can really fill it up quick. Scott with a nice find inside to Galen Smith. And you see Smith who find or uh, Smith goes up for the dunk here. Beatty's gonna have to force it, but he can't because he loses it up ahead. Easy lay in for Hamilton, who's now in double digits, the game leading score with 10 points. Nice poke from behind by uh, Hart, which led to Jarius Hamilton, the big guy, showing a little bit of that stutter step guard move that I see a lot from point guards. Stepping in the passing lane, Aaron Wiggins reading that one, but then the quick hands that time for Mason Gillis. The follow-up is there for Hart. Young players, that's why you always hustle. There's a lot to do with trying to get some confidence in, in that young man. And you see Wiggins right there. Very fortunate to maintain possession of that and get it to Hart. He's doing a great job of getting paint touches and looking opposite. And a strong take for Marcel. 29 against Michigan State on Christmas for Trice. Marcel, nice wraparound to Galen Smith for the bucket and the foul. Off the glass and then watch Marcel hold it just a little bit. Let's Galen Smith. Ayala, the lob and Wiggins with a two-hand flush. Great recognition by Merrill. Have looked really good here in the first half. Great recognition of Alley. Here's Marcel. The senior, nice no look pass inside to Hart for two. Yeah. Dante Scott has been very quiet for Maryland. And that's a big three. It jarred the ball loose, gets the turnover. Now Finnessy in the end, but Smith with a recovery to get the block. Three on the other end, and a little chest pound from Ayala. Glances left. That is a beautiful cross-court look. Catches Ayala with plenty, plenty of time to get that off. Against Rutgers. Garza missed the three. Hit ahead for Ayala. Got a layup. Maryland by eight. Boy, Iowa's defense not good. 
I mean, he dove in from the wing, Rob. His motor is, is really impressive. He, he just plays and competes so hard. Wiggins for three, his second of the half. Marcel Hart, Wiggins without Eric Ayala. Oh, no look pass to Hart. Beautiful by Wiggins. But let's go back and look at this. No look. Whoop. Just off the basketball, Akeem Hart cutting back door and have to give a lot of credit to Aaron Wiggins right here. The no-look pass, Maryland making some noise on the road. A long three put up and off the mark from Cottingham. A little bit rushed that possession. Hart down low and an easy bucket to get Maryland on the board. Freshman year shot 41%. Last year down to 31% as a sophomore and he's only hovering around 30% this year as well as a junior, Galen Smith. Terp swinging around for more sell. Down low to Galen Smith. Out to Hakeem Hart for three. Got it. Hakeem Hart, no mistake from the corner. But it is still a tight one. And Daryl Morcel trying to make things happen offensively. The three-pointer is the great equalizer for the D2 school, but it's working well for the D1 Maryland. Now Wilson ate a long three off the mark. Into the hands of Hakeem Hart. All the way down to Dante Scott, who throws one down himself. Take another look here. Maryland coming all the way down the other end for Scott to have one of himself. And they don't care whose night it is. He's talking about the Wolverine. They just find the open man. And Marcel baseline. And he said, if they exhale, they lose. They've got great respect for this Maryland team. That one is good out of the corner from Ayala, so five early points. Maryland's done a pretty good job of ball movement, and they find the open man, Eric Ayala, Johnny on the spot for that one. Ayala now cross court to Scott, hit one earlier, this time on the move. Through the lane, and Morcel lays it in, nicely done by the Terps. You've done a nice job right here. When you're playing five out on the penetration, if you get stopped, your teammates have. Here's Morcel against Potter. Nice feet, tough catch and finish. Really good work from Morcel to start that offensive play. Couldn't handle in the turnover. Watch this pass by Morcel. I, I didn't know if he was going to be able to get it through. Generate more opportunities based on their hustle. That will help. Good feed again from the top to the cutting Aaron Wiggins, and that gets Wiggins on the board with his first points of the night. Hunter cut off on his way to the hoop. Shot clock at 10, and it's stolen away. Morcell off to Wiggins, who lays it in, and a foul. Buckets we were talking about earlier. Maryland has to find a way to score and transition. Their half-court offense has been anemic, but that's what Wiggins needs to do. Draw the... at 10. Trying to drive it on the big man. Here is Wiggins out of the corner. Well done. Yeah, great job by Scott recognizing Edie cannot stay in front of him. There's the help. Ivy doesn't get out in time. And throws it up there. Off the heel, off the top of the <laughs> big board. And now Maryland's got a two-on-one. Hart with a nice play, getting it right back for Morsell to lay it in. Every player reacts a little bit differently to being shut down by Kobe. You know, depending on your conditioning, what you were and weren't able to do. Oh, Morsell climbs the ladder with authority in front of mom and dad. Stuffs it home. Back and forth, a little choppy, but here's a nice little highlight package. He thinks the offensive end of the game. Great job in success. Dante Scott lays it in. I love it to one end, just solid basketball. Little ball screen, little dive to the rim, and just a gorgeous delivery. Here's Hart backing down the smaller Walker, and then feeds more self pretty. Nice job. Nice feed inside and an easy layup. Count the bucket. And the field goal is good for Daryl Morcell. They're doing a nice job of moving the ball, finding cutters, and... Down low, nice pass from Ayala. Finds the open man and a timeout by Richard Pacino. A nice pop off the bench today. 
Iguodala found some room on the baseline. His wraparound pass to Dante Scott, and there's the first points of the second half. Conquer the triple team, kicks it out to the open shooter for an easy one. Morcel, what a find inside for Ayala. Great pass from Daryl Morcel. And then what vision. If you cut with integrity. The three up and off this time for Wiggins. Offensive rebound, Dante Scott. Wiggins, a second chance from the corner. This one falls. And him off the bench, and he's providing a big spark as the timeout hits. A great offensive rebound by Scott. Doesn't force it back up. It's one of the... Scott with three to shoot, finding the cutter Hart on the baseline, and Hart flips it in. The rebound for Maryland, Hakeem Hart will bring it up the floor. 4-0 start for the Scarlet Knights, and a good feed inside to Daryl Morsell. He's crafty with the first. Three outside, that's good, Hamilton. Hogard had the defense and has the rebound. Pocketed right there by Marcel. Three on two. Oh, the trailing Ayala slices for the deuce. You know, you try to push, and yeah, you want to, but Marcel, maybe the defensive player of the year, he takes the ball, and the result is not a Spartan fast break, but one for the Turks. In the post, finding out what the defense was doing, kicking it back out, and then the ball reversal helped. And that will stop the run. Wiggins unabated to the rim. But a pass too high. Dante Scott turns it over. And then Dante Scott gets it right back. Uh, Eric pass on the other end. Both teams a little sloppy. And Smith with the save to Morcell. The alley-oop and Hakeem Hart flying high. Daryl Morcell known more as a defender, but right here, he's setting up his teammate. That's a great alley-oop over the top. Play the point when pressed into that situation, but he's more comfortable doing that.